Well, the ride has made its way to Des Moines as Ragby riders are stopping for the night. Our team coverage continues now. Local 5's Larissa Leone is at Waterworks Park. But first, let's check back in with Connor O'Neill live at Confluence Brewing on what the scene is like uh, right now. Connor. You know what, Stephanie? I'm kind of jealous because you're in the studio right now. Everybody's at the news station. You guys are staying cool. I'm out here. Look at me. I'm out in the sun right now. We're in all black and it's super hot out, but bikers are arriving right here. You see all these bikes right behind me, around me. Now, tens of thousands of people are coming to Confluence Brewery in Des Moines, and they're just coming for some drinks, hanging out with their groups that they were biking with all day for day four of Ragbri, and they're just trying to stay cool any way possible as this sun just continues to beat down. Now I'm going to toss it over to Larissa Leone. She's out in Waterworks Park. I'm jealous because I'm super hungry, Larissa. How's that food smelling over there at Waterworks Park? I tell you what, Connor, it's a good time. I'm having my living my best life. It's really lively here, and I'm snacking on this little mm, this tasty treat from Ruby Bees, and they had a goal to make this week. Our goal today is to sell a thousand dinners and we're at 998. So we're working on it. We got a whole day ahead of us. We sell what you call soul food. I can almost feel you breathe. Yeah, and coming up tonight at 5, we'll hear from more riders. I'll try some more food, but to now, I'm going to get back to this food. So have a great time. We'll see you back there then. As you should, Larissa, and Rod there, he may be my new favorite person. I like his enthusiasm. 